Sarah Galley. I'm the producer of Born for Broadway, and this is my story. There are 5.6 million Americans that are currently affected by paralysis, and what the Reed Foundation really um, is a leading advocate of is not only helping with medical research, but also quality of life grants. Um, I started the event because my brother is a high-level quadriplegic. He has actually the same level of injury that Chris Reed had, and that's why we've all come together and been so passionate, not only about funding medical research, but also really helping those that are affected by paralysis now. Um, because we could find a cure tomorrow, which would be amazing, but we really do need to help support and enable the people that are um, dealing with spinal cord injuries today. I started an event held annually at the school called Bound for Broadway, and it kind of grew year after year, and upon graduation started working on a gala, which is why we're here today, called Born for Broadway, which will be October 4th here at New World Stages. It's a one-night-only celebrity musical review. It's being directed by Tony nominee Marsha Milgram Dodge, who just came off the amazing production of Ragtime, of course. Our musical director is Larry Yerman. The show itself will be hosted by Kathy Lee Gifford, which we are incredibly excited for. We think she's amazing, just the right amount of sassy, which is what Born for Broadway is all about. Um, and then we have Lilius White, the wonderful Leslie Gore. Um, we have amazing performers. And our full cast and contact information can all be found at bornforbroadway.com, as well as some amazing video of our first annual gala, which was held last year. Actually, this year we are incredibly excited because all of the costs of the event have been covered through some very, very generous donors, which means that every dollar spent uh, for the ticket price goes directly to the foundation. So we're really excited and anticipating a great response from the theater community, which is so beloved. Um, Chris and Dana were an enormous part of the performing arts world and especially a part of Broadway, and we're really hoping that that communicates into a great response the night of the show. What we've been really excited about has been the response from the community, not only based in New York, but also nationally. And we would like to gently remind people that you can still support the event, even if you're unable to attend on October 4th. If you go to bornforbroadway.com, there will be more information directly um, donating to the foundation itself so that you're still able to be a part of the night, even if you're not able to be in the audience, which we're incredibly, incredibly grateful for. We're really excited about the response that we've had and certainly our understanding of the financial situation that many people are in, especially in the Broadway community, which is why our price point is so, um, I think, respectful of those needs. We do have rush tickets available that are actually available today at the box office if you want to go inside right after this. We have $30 tickets, and again, those $30 are going directly to the foundation. Uh, so we have $30 tickets, we have $75 tickets, and of course our wonderful premium orchestra for those that are, are willing to be a, a true patron of the arts with the foundation. Those are $125. So we have a really nice price point, and again, it is a charitable event, and we're appreciative of any donations that people are able to make. There will also be great raffle prizes that day, so if you're attending another of the wonderful shows at New World Stages, you'll still have a way to get involved. We're also really incredibly grateful to the people, not only in our cast, but our production staff. Marsha Milgram Dodge, who has um, really just been an amazing, incredible, incredible support and really the person that I look to when I think of someone that's making a difference in the Broadway community. Um, I've known Marsha since I was a sophomore in college. I actually started out by a, um, being an assistant director of a show she'd produced, uh, directed in school, and she really stands out as, as what we're trying to do, being um, an upstanding, wonderful example of the Broadway community that is donating their time for a truly worthy cause.